Hello, I am Test Drive, and welcome to episode 74 of Project Gotham Racing 2. In this episode, we have a street race to do at Edinburgh Grass Market West, and I'm going to be using the Porsche Carrera GT because, yeah, because it's cool. <coughs> Which sounds good enough to me for a reason to use it. And there's the castle at Edinburgh. 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 Yes. That's exactly how you say it right there. Let's go. Ooh, there's a 911 GT1 up there. I want the 911 GT1, but I'm not going to get it, sadly. Later, nerd. Uh, I'm going to get pinched against him. Not quite. Oh, God. Ow. I don't know why any of the cars in this game sound like anything they do. Don't ask me these questions. Oh, hello, 911 G21, please. Oh, you bastard. Ow. Ow, oh, cunts. Go, please. <clears throat> what is the hold up, you fuck? I'm in last place. I'm behind the fucking 4 GT. Are you kidding me? God, I'm gonna cry. I have yet to hear a Kura GT actually in person. I think I've heard them through videos, but never heard one in person. Understandably, because they're extremely rare, and uh, I'm not just gonna find one around St. Louis usually. I'm sure there's probably at least one around here somewhere, but uh, it's not going to be uh, out and about very often. I did see a 918, though. Basically, uh, we had a delivery of some cars for my the car dealership I worked at, and uh, one of the cars they had to move out of the truck to get the cars that the dealership or the, my, the dealership I was at was getting uh, one of the cars was a 918. Yeah, the Courage GT is actually ridiculous sounding. Okay, that was really close to being death. I like how I instantly, as soon as I hit that car, I got a fucking nice, uh, nice corner, or good line, whatever. I'm pretty sure it's not very far off from being a legit F1 V10. I have no clue, because I don't know much about Kara GTs, but I would imagine pretty ridiculous. I drove a Viper at one point. It was pretty cool. It was a first gen. And it was fast. Not quite the big fast, but, but fast. And it would easily roast the 335, or 335? 355 maybe? Wide tires on the back? I don't remember exactly how wide they were. I know that they were ridiculous though. Because I'm pretty sure the front tires in that Viper were wider than the rear tires on the Shelby GT350R Mustang that we also had at the same time at that dealership. Can I pass one more car before the race ends? That is a question. It's possible, but not too far off. I'm going to guess it's a Zonda in front of me. guessing. Judging by the V8 sounds I'm hearing, I'm going to say it's Zonda.
I'm here, bastard. I don't really see what you are. It is a Zonda. That was correct. Oh, fuck. Later, nerd. Okay. Okay. Oh, that was close. Hmm. Best V10 is the Ram V10. The 8.0. That's the only one that matters. Get in your Dodge Ram 2500 or 3500. Possibly even with a Pfizer manual. They do exist, but they're rare. 28, 28 kudos. Definitely not going to be able to pass first place. Is that the. That's not an LMG21, isn't it? I can almost guarantee that it is. Oh, fuck. Ouchies. Renault V10? I have no clue what that would be in. No first place. I'll take second place, though. I'm alright with this. I'm stupid. Am I stupid? I think I am stupid. I don't think I saved a replay on the last one. I don't know. I'll figure it out tomorrow at some point. Alright, so now we have all we have left is the final race, which is a two-lap race of the North Shalifa, and we're going to be doing it in the next episode. So thank you all so much for watching this one, and I will see you in that next one.